It kind of seems like Electric Zoo. It's taking its name a bit too literally. I had to shut down admissions early tonight because of capacity issues, and this was the final night of the festival. People were so angry that they ended up rushing the gates, prompting police to step in, and we have photos that show the aftermath after people rushed those gates. Uh, people reportedly waited for hours at will call, but were never able to get in because of capacity issues. The festival has had problems all three nights. It was completely canceled on Friday because of supply chain issues that delayed completion of the stage. Last night, hundreds of people waited in line for hours and couldn't get in. And tonight, Electric Zoo tweeted at 6.30 that because of Friday's cancellation, they had reached capacity earlier than anticipated and had to close admission. We talked to a woman from Pennsylvania who witnessed that chaos but never got into the festival, costing her several hundred dollars. People just rushed the gates. They just kind of like went through the barricades, went through the security, whatever little security they had, and just ran into the festival, just like completely just sprinted. We actually extended our stay so we could stay tonight because we thought, oh, we'll be there late. We don't want to drive home. So we spent another couple hundred to stay an extra night. And here we are. <laughs> Electric Zoo says that everyone who was denied entrance today will get a full refund. The NYPD has shut down all shuttles and roadways leading onto Randall's Island, but the festival is making sure that ferries and buses are running to take people off the island who are still there enjoying the concerts.